Government Haraba State have set up a committee to sustain enduring peace between the two warring communities in both states. This committee will visit affected areas to determine the level of destruction. They are expected to submit their findings to the two governors of both states. Representatives of Taraba and Benue state governments are at this peace parley following the recent inter-ethnic crisis involving communities in the two states. Key players of the boundary communities, security chiefs and traditional rulers of the two states were at the joint security meeting held at Federal University Wukari where steps were taken to prevent future recurrence. The loss of any life irrespective of tribe or religion is uncalled for and should not be tolerated by any person, group, or faith. We as government are not happy and will not encourage anyone. In order to find a lasting solution to this problem, it is important to know if there are underlying factors. Otherwise, there was a problem between two people one was arrested and detained, and then was given a bail. Is that enough for an attack to take place? Commissioners of Police of Taraba and Benue states appealed to community leaders from both sides to take preventive steps against such action in future and condemned the crisis. Tribal conflict, religious conflict of whatever dimension has become a thing of the past. It is an act of ignorance, act of irresponsibility. The society, development, the modern world has passed that stage. We of the Benue State Command consider that the present crisis that is happening between two brothers and sisters, if you like, is uncalled for. The joint security meeting visited the Chunku, Vaase, and Kinti communities for an on the spot assessment caused by the crisis where they interacted with residents. During the visits, the deputy governors emphasized the need for peaceful coexistence amongst the Tiv and Yukun communities along the boundaries of the two states in the interest of development. I believe that uh, this is not something that everyone will condone. It is something that everybody should condemn, and it's very sad that it has happened to this dimension. The Jukun and the Thief are brother and, brothers and sisters. Uh, unfortunately, we found ourselves in this uh, sad situation, or this unfortunate situation. Deputy Governor of Taraba State read the communique where he advised the youth of the affected communities to sheath their swords. Residents in the affected communities hope to see peace returned to the area as many peace accords have been signed.